what's up guys so i'm back to give some messages i know i've been gone for a while honestly um i have been working but i was actually off for a little bit and i was pretty drained i don't know if you guys can hear me so i do want to talk up because some people said they can't hear me um but i was pretty drained um and i didn't every time i wanted to do a reading it felt this i felt this like pull from my cards um so there was definitely some energies being sent to me and i'm going to be doing an egg egg cleanse today um and i'm pretty sure it's going to say a lot so i'll update you guys on that but i'm going to get into some regular um collective uh a collective reading for you guys um, and just see what comes out. It'll probably be really quick. Um, and yeah, we'll just see what the energy is holding and what, you know, the divine has to say for the collective. So let's see what it has. What's about to come out. Also, um, welcome to all my new subscribers. And thank you guys for all the likes and subscribes and comments. I love you all so much. And I appreciate each and every one of you. All right. All right. Let's just like let the spirit. So we have here the healing card out along with the seven of wands so you're healing after having to defend yourself and guard something um yeah you definitely um had to take charge or step into a either a boss like energy or a dominant energy in a certain situation um you you came out on top in this situation, um, but you are healing overall from this um, and grounding yourself and realigning um, because something could have definitely felt overwhelming or overbear overbearing. It could have felt like you against a lot of people or a lot of things happening at one time um, to you. Something could have happened with work or with the job situation. Something could have happened with the boss or um, you stepped into a boss mentality or a boss position. Yeah, then we have the 10 of Pentacles here as well. So yeah, you succeed in this situation. A lot of abundance came out from this situation. Either you upgraded in position at work or um, your money is you're you're receiving more money at this time um a lot of things are just flowing for you in the abundance area oh this is a lot all right let me just go ahead and take these Okay, so somebody, um, it could have been a certain situation or a certain person that came in um, with the offer to try to cause some sort of destruction or some sort of um, ending, like a, a permanent ending or an ending that, like, a domino effect of badness. Yeah, because we have the tower with the ten of swords that pops out here and I happen to place the ten of swords on top of the seven of swords which was I mean the seven of wands so it's like you were defending yourself against something or a certain situation or a certain person maybe you had an intuitive nudge or something about a certain person or a certain situation maybe a work situation I don't know or a person that you work with or a person that you deal with 
Um, and so you felt like you had to defend yourself against this person and you, you were right um, because someone was trying to cause a tower moment for you. Someone wanted you to like fail at something, but you ended up succeeding regardless because we have here the six of wands, you know, so you receive recognition and you succeed um, at whatever it is you were doing. And the Six of Wands fell right on top of the Ten of Pentacles. So it's like ultimate success. And it, this was destined for you as well. Messages for the Collective Spirit. Yeah, Five of Swords. Somebody wanted to come in and start some sort of conflict. Messages for the Collective Ace of Cups and the Seven of Cups. Love. Yeah. Somebody could have been envy. Okay, so this could be a person. This could be a person that was envious of um maybe your mm -hmm. you, okay, so you're you're succeeding in like work and finances. You're so you're succeeding like overall and you and you work really hard for this. So you're defensive. Um not defensive, but you you worked really hard and defended and stood your ground um towards what you build right um and you became really successful from this this began this was a seed that you planted that flourished um regardless of the trials and tribulations you still overcame them and worked hard someone is envious of this because you healed yourself from some certain situation. The first card that came out was the healing card. You healed yourself from some certain situation. And everything is flowing now. Like, fantastically. <laughs> everything is flowing greatly. You know what I'm saying? And someone wants to come in and make you, like, fall or fail in every area. But this is not working. And this could had this could have something to do with love. Someone definitely wants to come in and cause some type of conflict in your love life. But it's like, some of you guys are unaware that some love is coming in because you have so many options as well with the Seven of Cups. You have a lot of options in every area of your life right now. And it's like, love is one of them. Yeah, the lovers. Yeah, love is definitely one of them. With the Ten of Cups. Okay, so there's love coming in. For sure. So you have some sort of like soulmate. Divine partner. Divine counterpart coming in, right? Somebody doesn't want this to happen. Somebody doesn't want this to happen. I don't know who the hell this person is. But they don't want you two to come together. There is something that is coming. This There is something that is like destined to happen and somebody does not want this shit to happen period point blank messages for the collective spirit seven of pentacles with the nine of swords Wow, so somebody's really trying to, like, somebody's really trying to, like, conflict you in some sort of way. Yeah, four swords with the page of wands coming out here. Somebody's trying to, like, get creative with some type of mental conflict, come up with some type of game plan of some sort to slow this down or um, fuck this up. And they're becoming anxious because you're actually very intuitive, and you're picking up on this, so you know who this person is. Wow, look how that flipped out. <laughs> I said you're actually very intuitive, and the Queen of Cups pop out. I'm not fucking kidding. You're actually very intuitive. You're sen like sen sensitivity, um, but no, like you, um, you've picked up on this. Your gut, or you, um, or very um spiritually inclined for some of you but yeah 
So you already know who this person is or you already know what they're trying to do? Mm-hmm, Six of Cups. So this is, you already know who this person is. This is somebody you know. You've known. This could be someone from your childhood, someone you worked with in the past, someone you went to school with, um, someone... You play some sort of sport with. I don't know. King of Wands popping out here. We also have the the Emperor card that came out earlier. So there's there's this masculine here. There's this man here. That's a lot of cards. Messages for the collective. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. Oh shit. Somebody loyal is a motherfucker. Somebody want to come in with a solid offer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. King of Pentacles. Somebody want to come in with a solid offer. Uh-huh. This person is stable, wealthy. Yeah, this person is a protector as well with the Nine of Wands. This person is a protector. They're not going to play about you. They don't They don't play that shit about you. We also have here the um, the Knight of Wands, so activity. This person is, they, they don't go about you. Like, when, it, when it's about that action, they, they will be on go about you. Also, this person is coming in super fucking fast. Y'all, if y'all ain't already meet this person, they finna come in fast. You know who this person is, too. Like, intuitively, somebody senses, yeah, mm -hmm. somebody senses that um, this is going on. Eight of Swords with the Page of Cups. Yeah, so there's this, like, cr this person trying to creep in, right? Because they know what's going on, and they want to cause some type of blockage, some type of restriction. Somebody wants to cause some type of blockage because they know that this is a divine, like, binding you know what i'm saying wow so is it there's really a hater lurking what the fuck weirdo a weirdo is lurking a weirdo knight of cups with the king of swords okay So somebody is like, oh, and it, that's not the Knight of Cups. It's the King of Cups, y'all. My bad. King, King of Cups with the King of Swords. So, y'all, this masculine is like the Emperor. Yes, he's all the kings. You know what I'm saying? He not playing. Okay? And so somebody's really trying to come in and block something, but they're not even spiritually as strong physically as strong, mentally as strong. This is a battle this person cannot face. This was the two of wands reverse. This is a battle this person cannot face. They they don't have they they whatever they making the wrong decision, the wrong choice. They're going the wrong way trying to fucking pick a war, a battle with this fucking emperor. You know what I'm saying? Somebody's literally trying to block this divine union but this emperor is not playing about you this emperor wants to come in and be with you but someone's trying to come in and block that but this emperor is peeping because he's also he's also spiritually inclined as well so both of y'all peeping eight of wands this shit is coming in fast like i said Y'all spiritually inclined. This shit is this information is coming in to y'all fast. Through the noggin. Through the crown. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I'm so serious. Like, y'all on it. Mm-hmm. Y'all peeping this motherfucker. So it's like this person trying to come in and be a blockage, but both of y'all know what's going on. So this person really looks like a clown. Stupid. Like a mouse caught in a trap, but he ain't feel his tail get caught yet. Damn. Messages for the collective spirit. Messages for the collective. Alright. 
Five of Wands. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Six of Wands, Ace of Wands. So some this this person was trying to compete. And they did not, it did not, it didn't, they failed, okay? This person was trying to compete with a fucking emperor. I t I'm, t I'm telling y'all, this motherfucker was trying to go up against an emperor. The king of all kings. God, th th this person is, they win all wars, okay? Six, six of swords. Smooth fucking sailing. Because guess what? Ace of Wands. That was an easy fucking mission. I'm all action, baby. Masculine Aries energy. Emperor. I'm all, I'm all action, baby. Ace of Wands. Okay? Yeah. Justice will be fucking served. <laughs> smooth sailing this was a war a battle that this person could not win this was a war that they picked they picked their poison pretty much yeah that's that's that so let's get some angels and ancestors messages messages that you got for the collective messages that you got for so let's let's put them all back. <laughs> That's really a lot, though. Let's see what you got. Okay, cause I ain't gonna put them all the way back in. Broken arrow. Embrace the energy of peace. Yeah, so everything's going to be smooth sailing, like I was saying before. Um, because this person, they didn't... Yeah, this was not their battle to be having, you know what I'm saying? They will be coming out in the end very injured, if not, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, for the most part, everything will be very peaceful and smooth sailing for you guys. And you will be able to really embrace and endure and establish this relationship and you know what i'm saying go on the journey of y'all divine partnership and it will be very fun so messages that you have for the collective spirit hmm. we have here stag trust and thrive eagle see from a higher perspective White witch, be the light. Great teacher, learn from spiritual experiences. And traveler, move in new direction. Those all flipped over, so I'm just going to take them all. Um, so for the most part, it looks like here um, you're going to take a leap of faith with this person. Um, and you're getting this type of insight from the divine from higher ups you know in the spiritual realm um yeah especially with white witch here and eagle um this is all coming from up there you know what i'm saying and this is also a divine connection that they're sending in for you so this will feel right so make sure you go with that intuitive nudge that you're going to be having yeah with great teacher here learn from spiritual experiences you're going to know that this is like the real deal from you know past experiences and things that you went through before you know what i'm saying and all the lessons that you've endured and that you also help other th people through through your experiences so you're going to know what feels right and what is right through you know what i'm saying things that didn't work in the past or things that didn't flow or end it roughly whatever those were lessons and you know what i'm saying you learned from them and so now you know what is going to be right or what suits you or fits you best. So this is all like guided. And yeah, traveler. So this is this is going to be something new for you and it's it's going to be new and elevated because it's not going to be nothing like your past relationships or past lovers or 
past situations, just like this person trying to come in and cause a war, it's not going to be nothing like that because you have elevated and this partner is also on the elevation that you're at vibrating, you know what I'm saying? So this is going to be a completely new relationship and you're going to be looking at it in completely new sights, you know, and um, everything's going to flow, it's going to be good and don't be nervous, don't be so... um defensive you know because you're used to fighting and being so defensive but this person is willing to fight for you and I think something about that is going to be very comforting and make you feel safe and you're going to be able to open up in ways you haven't been able to in a long time you've been very closed off towards people um, maybe um, even when it comes to um, making friends or or making a friend group or uh, lovers or co-workers or things like that you might be closed off you know to adding people in or letting them really get to know you but with this person something about them is going to make you feel really safe something about the way they protect you or going to come in and protect you from this person the way they're going to protect you from situations that are threatening this connection is going to make you feel very safe and comfortable and um, everything about this is, is going to feel unfamiliar because you've never had this before. You never had everything you desired in the actual partner, divine partner, all in one before. So this is going to feel like a complete gift. And it is. So feel very grateful. Be very grateful. Express your gratitude because this is coming in. And I'm super happy and excited for you as well. Um, this just feels very securing. And it feels very, you know, like you can breathe. And it's just a, a really... Um, I don't know. I'm just smiling really hard. So you're going to be smiling really hard and just feeling very, like, happy and not, I want to say accomplished, but not like this was some type of target goal. It was a goal for you, but it's like a wish come true, you know, and it is because the universe is granting a wish for you. They're making this happen for you. Some of you guys really wanted your person your person you wanted a person for you someone that understands you love you gets you you know grows with you and is all about you and is loyal and is there and you know is supportive and just all that you want wrapped up in one and they're delivering this to you so I hope you're open and optimistic and, you know, ready to receiving because this is coming in. And there's definitely going to be someone trying to come in, budging in, trying to cause some type of conflict. Um, This person could be a past lover or some person that, you know, you didn't, didn't work out with in the past or somebody that you rejected. Something like that. Somebody that's really stirred up and conflicted about this lover. This could also be a friend or a family member or something weird like that. This person's trying to budge in, you know, and cause some sort of conflict or blockage within this divine connection because someone knows and feels this coming in. So don't be confused. You're going to know what's right and it's going to feel right. And this person is your divine person. And I've been telling you that throughout this whole reading. This is going to feel right. And this other person, you're going to know that it's wrong because it's going to feel wrong. And it might also be some someone or something that's familiar. So... That's going to be a huge tip or a nudge in this situation. This person is going to be either familiar and it's, or it's going to feel very wrong. So that's what that person that's going to try to budge in and cause a blockage. But for the most part, you're going to know this because you're very um, spiritually inclined and very intuitive. And so is your masculine. So don't worry about that. You guys are a perfect match. So thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with another video. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, yes. And yeah. <laughs> Talking through me out. Bye, guys. That was awkward. <laughs>